I welcome you to this video. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can upload videos to your YouTube channel. Once you have a Gmail account and you are logged into your Chrome, for the purpose of this training, I am using Chrome browser and that is what I want you to use too. So ensure you have downloaded your Chrome browser and that is the one you'll be using. So make sure you have logged into your email account and launch your Chrome. You may not have all, all this. For me, I already have shortcut for YouTube. But in case you don't have, don't worry. You can see there are several ways we can access YouTube here. I can access it here. I can type YouTube youtube.com here and I'll press enter once I press enter now I'll be on YouTube alternatively you click you click on this nine dot and here you have YouTube so you click on this now I am on YouTube so far you have a channel and you are logging there is a difference between logging to your Gmail and logging to YouTube so you have to log into YouTube once you are logging to YouTube you click on your profile icon here okay then you will see view channel for me i have more than one channel so since i have more than one channel it depends on the one i want to use so i have a channel that is called timothy omatule omatule timothy i have a channel called omatule timothy i have another channel called acting consult so for this video i want to use acting consult so i'm going to click on switch channel and here is the channel I want to use. I will open it. And here I am. This is the YouTube home page. I want to go to my channel. I can click on here to go to my channel. Okay. And alternatively, I can upload my videos directly from here. Okay. So to upload the video, simply locate this icon. Okay, once you are, you are on your channel, you make sure that you are logged into your channel. If you are not sure, you click on your icon, view channel. And right now I am on my channel now. Okay, so I click on this icon, create, upload video okay i believe you know how to create your video so i'm going to select file and it will take me to the folder this is the file i want to upload this is the video i want to upload make sure you have named the video very well because the name you give to the video will determine whether it's going to rank well on YouTube. Okay. Ensure you have named it properly according to the content of the video. Okay. This is the video I want to use. You can see this is the name. How to export title block from lower version of Revit. Okay. The title is okay. So I select it. Open. And now it is uploading okay it's uploading now this one was done automatically i did this one automatically the description you can see the title the title of the video automatically show as the title okay and it's going to help your video to rank well this is where you are going to type your description this description you are seeing here was done automatically 
and in the next video i will show you how you can do that okay so that it saves your time you can see i have added the link to my social medias all my social media pages i have added all the link automatically for any video i'm uploading all this link must be there it helped me to gain more followers on social media because some people from my youtube channel follow me on my page and after some time they become my customer or my clients okay so it's going to help you a lot okay then this is where you are going to upload your thumbnail okay now i designed my thumbnail in canva and i am using a paid version of canva i am using canva pro meaning i am paid um, i don't like using free because there are so many things i want to use if you are using a free version of canva you won't be able to have access to some things okay so there are so many things you cannot use like this arrow i use now you can see it's pro it means that if you are using free you won't be able to do it you won't be able to use it and like this uh, revit icon revit logo i change the background this image you can change the background if you are using a pro version all you need to do is to select it click background remover but if you are using a free version you won't be able to remove the background so in case you want to have access to my paid pro please contact me on whatsapp and i will show you how you can have access to the pro version instead of paying huge amounts of money you pay very little and you have access to the pro version pay just a little amount of money okay so this is why i designed my my thumbnail and i've already designed one already i'm not going to go into the detailing of how you use canva for today's video okay so here we are here you are going to write the description of the video make sure you write it what the video is about just a summary and you'll be good to go i don't want i don't want to waste too much of my time so i'm just going to copy this and paste it in the in the description but for you ensure you take your time to type the description so that your video can rank well on youtube all right then let me select the thumbnail if your channel is new you will not have access to select your thumbnail until you have verified your account so if you are new if your channel is new ensure you have verify your account so that you'll be able to up upload thumbnail okay so i'm going to go to where my thumbnail is this is my thumbnail okay what i normally do is i rename my thumbnail to be the same name as the title of the video it helps it to rank well on google there are some people that are looking for that if they are typing those keywords on google google is going to rank your image and by the time they click on the image it will direct them to your video it will help your video to rank better okay so i've renamed the thumbnail to be the exact name as the video so i'm going to select it now and open it and make sure you take your time to design your thumbnail very well because it's one of the things that will make your channel to grow faster because your thumbnail determine whether some people will click on it and watch the video or not it is what is on the thumbnail that will make them to watch and then you select your 
playlist ensure you have created a playlist depends on the content of the video okay now this video is all about revit tutorial so i select revit tutorial masterclass and it's in my paid course okay i select this one no it is not for kid okay then let's go further let's go further this is where you are going to type your the tags what is the video about okay for me i did it automatically okay and i will show you in the next video how you can do this tag automatically it saves your time so that every video you are uploading on this channel will have at least these tags this tag will help your video to rank well either on google or on youtube so it is very very important okay uh, this one is because i'm having a vid iq that's why i have this privilege to select this don't worry for now you'll be getting to know it one after the other so let's still go all right let's go let's go let's go let's go further let's go further we're going gently okay so we are okay with this i click next now for you you may not see this if you are a new channel you will not see this if your channel is not yet monetized you will not see this for me it is monetized so i want to monetize this video i want to be making money from this video so i will earn my monetization so as people are watching it and they happen to tap on the ad i will make profit from it okay so that is it i've on my monetization option then i'll click next then this this one are all uh, monetization rituals so i need to do them you may not bother so much about the monetization now until you are done for monetization okay so i'm going to click next okay then i click next and i'll click next now this is visibility you want here you want to determine who have access to the video if you put it on private there is only few persons whom you select their email address that will have access to the video then if you select unlisted it means that those that you send the link that will have access to the video only the public will not have access to it okay so it depends on your choice if for instance the video you are uploading is your course is the video from your course and you don't want the public to have access to it means you leave it at unlisted but if you want the public to have access to it you are going to select public okay for this video I will select public though it's not all my video that the public have access to it but for this one i want to give it to the public so i select that public and i will hit publish and here i can share the link on my whatsapp group I will share it on my Facebook timeline and the rest of them. So this is where you can share it on social media. You can share it on Facebook. You can share it on LinkedIn, on Twitter, on WhatsApp, Pinterest, email, and, and so on and so forth. You know, when you upload your videos like this, the public may not see it yet until you share it. If you share it on your platforms from there, you start getting your first views okay so you need to share it so that 
people will get to discover your channel gradually okay so i'm going to share this one on my whatsapp now okay so this is where i'm going to stop this video for today i'm sure you benefit a lot from this video if you do ensure you give me a video testimonial thank you for watching this video see you in the next video bye